Hi, um, it's Isa again. We're here with Devin Hayes. All right, so can it's weird you... to say my own name. It's weird. <laughs> Hi, Devin Hayes. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so, can you tell us a little bit about who you are and what you're doing? Yeah, I'm um, an 18 year old singer songwriter from small town, Springfield, Illinois. Um, I just came out with a new album called The Mind's Diary. Uh, I've been really kind of pushing this uh, new or pushing this kind of music industry thing. I used to be like a social media influencer, you could say, and mm -hmm. going on the like the Digi Tour and all these old, you know, social media stuff. And I, I really feel like it's it's better for me to push more um, through my passions, which is music. And I really want to like be more professional with that and and go down that route because it's my favorite thing to do. So awesome. So when did you begin um, making music and switching from social media to now? Yeah, I began. Um, I picked up the guitar about like seven or eight years old. Um, my dad threw me in some guitar lessons to see how, how I'd like it because he grew up in a band him, himself um, and he kind of wanted to see if his son had the same talents or interests as he did. Mm -hmm. And um, so uh, I started taking lessons of guitar and I absolutely loved it and music just kind of started coming to me and I started in school plays from fourth grade to freshman year. Um, something just being in front of a crowd really just excited me and, and made me feel alive and I kind of translated those two things like the stage charisma and, and the singing and the guitar to kind of just like form myself into um, this artist and, and this dream that I that I so wanted um, and uh, yeah it just kind of developed over time and um, I kind of like got fed up with the school play stuff because I kind of wanted to be myself more uh, yeah. write my own stuff sing how I wanted to sing stuff like that and um, I was a really bad singer at starting off. I was pretty, pretty bad, but um, just the concert work and, and a lot of passion kind of helped me to become a better artist. So. That's great. So what type of music, what genre of music are you yeah. producing currently? I would say like pop R&B, you know, not like so much R&B and not so much pop, but like right in between. Um, I kind of, some examples or kind of influences that I'm, I'm, I look up to is like Fozzy, The Chainsmokers, music like that. It's kind of uh -huh. like dreamy and, and, and kind of hype and stuff like that. So um, I don't know, right in between there. That's great. So what are you expecting from this tour? What are you looking to receive from it? Yes, before I started this tour, um, I thought to myself, like, well, for one, it's Jake Miller. You know, he's a super cool guy. It'd be yeah. amazing to, to tour with Jake Miller, you know, and I, I grew up listening to his, mu his music because he was in the social media game as well, you know, coming out with all these, these bangers and stuff. And all my other friends were uh, performing it on stage while we were, like, doing these, you know, influencer uh, events and stuff. And I was like, who's this Jake Miller guy? And then saw he was going on tour, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to hit him up, and next thing you know, I'm on here. But one, the, the biggest thing I was looking forward to is to kind of separate myself from the um, social media tour type of guy to the more music industry type of guy. I feel like this is a great way to get in the door a little more. and Because um, this is the first time I've opened for somebody on, like, a tour like a, like a real tour, not like a digi tour or something when there's like 20 other people, you know, it's just me and Jake. So this is really, really a great experience and it's good for me to learn off of. And Jake's really good for me to learn off of. Me and him had a lot of good talks and um, I, th I think the key to this industry is knowledge. Um, knowledge is power. So I do whatever I can to talk to anybody that has any sort of experience in here. And um, Jake really expi inspires me to do this even more, so. That's great. So how have your fans reacted from your switch from social media to music? Yeah. Uh, have they gone with you? Yeah, I feel like <laughs> maybe half of them have. Uh -huh. <laughs> There's still a lot of other ones that, um, you know, stick to the, the old game and they're just like, oh, who's this new Devin? We want the cheesy, like, uh, you're so beautiful type on Twitter. <laughs> like, you know, you're tweeting out that uh -huh. cheesy stuff. But um, um, I just know, I don't know, um, through all those years, I kind of put like a fake wall up a little bit between me and my followers and, and um, I don't know, doing whatever I could to get to get likes, get favorites, whatever it was. Um, and now I feel like I can be more me and I can be more real through this um, this industry and this um, music. Um, and a lot of a lot of my old fans definitely translated into that and they, they do like the new me because um, of their passion for music too. Um, yeah. I feel like I feel like a few years ago um, when all the social media was blowing up. Um, everybody wanted to do music and it became and people became less passionate about it and, and they kind of like lowered their standards a little bit to what they wanted to hear. Mm -hmm. I feel like everything's coming back up now and I'm getting myself into that door. So. That's great. Mm -hmm. So um, is there anything you'd like to announce or tell our viewers that's coming up for you? Oh, hell yeah. Go check out my new album. It's my <laughs> first album I ever put out. It's called The Mind's Diary. Um, I put a lot of passion and hard work into this one. Um, I went through a pretty rough patch in my life, as we all do. And I went to music and it practically saved me, like saved my mind and, 
and save my sadness. I don't know. I feel I just I feel much better after writing this album, and I hope you guys can connect with it. It's on Spotify, iTunes. Um, physical copies on DevonHaysMerch.com. Go, you know, a little promo there. Um, but yeah, just go check it out. All right, thank you so much Thanks again. So much. I'm Isla from Pop Entertainment, and I was here with Devin Hayes. Hey, I'm Devin Hayes, and you're watching Pop Entertainment.